Um, I was born in Iraq, on Bag in Baghdad, um, near the Tigris uh, River, and I was um, forced to I fled away from uh, Iraq to Iran because I was active in the um, um, leftist underground that is, that is uh, the Communist Party in, in Iraq. Um, while living in Iraq, I was a part of the Iraqi society who struggled for freedom from building a, a new society. Um, the, the struggle was very, very harsh, very danger, dangerous. My two friends were killed um, uh, in, the, in, in that struggle. Uh, then I, was, I saw m many people who were, um, uh, um, uh, fought with, with me, uh, Jews, Muslims, and Christians together. So I came to Israel. Uh, when sitting in Iran, there was a danger that the Iranian government sent me back to Iraq, and I have no other way to go, only to come to Israel. So I came to Israel as a new immigrant from Iraq, uh, with uh, that is with the, coming with the language of the enemy, the heritage of the uh, enemy. I was uh, talking on. Uh, uh, my mother language was uh, Arabic, and even the color of my, my face was the, of, of the enemy. So naturally, I found my way in the first days or uh, years here in Haifa, and not in other country, uh, other city in Israel. The, in Haifa, I, I would say it is the nearest uh, the uh, city which can say uh, which is normal in the Middle East, where Jews and Arabs living together. I wouldn't say that it is something very ideal, but is I would say the uh, uh, Haifa is the only city which you are in the Middle East, which uh, in it you are not afraid because you are Jew or. Or Muslim, or, or, uh, or Christian, or Jew, or, or Israeli, or non, not Israeli, Arab, or Israeli or Arab. Um, so I, my first year, years, I lived in the Wadi Nisnaz, which is a, a mi, where a mixture of Jews and the, and the Arabs, and thought the majority was Arabs. I worked in the Arab Arab um, newspaper for five years. Um, then I came to the conclusion that I can't go, go on living there because um, I wanted to, um, to be a writer and to, to write in the langu language of the country, which is Hebrew, so that I'm, I left the party, the Communist Party, after the 20th uh, Congress in the Soviet Union. Uh, we, after the, uh, the, telling the story what happened uh, during the days of Stalin, and I left um, the Wadi and and uh, I lived here. Um, I have good rela relations with with uh, Arab. Um, uh, um, 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 uh, part of of Haifa, I I till feel uh, till now, after sixty years in Israel, as um, as a uh, different mentality menta mentally from the majority of Israel, um, um, living here and. Uh, uh, in Israel, um, and uh, feeling the, the the how you say the feeling of uh, 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 as a person who living besieged uh, by countries who don't uh, till today um, uh, uh, who. Uh, 
that the Isra Israeli has no uh, right to live in the Middle East. And uh, unfortunately to say that the ruling part of Israel did everything to, to build this image that Israel is outside the Middle East. Uh, through all its history, wanted to prove that it is part of Europe and not part of the, the Middle East. Uh, the, the history of Israel, Israel is the history of wars. And here, living here in Haifa, it is the, for me, it is the uh, living in the most normal city in the Middle East. There is also a killing in Haifa, in, in, uh, like in every city in Israel, but only Arab kill Arabs, Jews kill Jews, but no Arab, no, not in 50, 60 years, no Arab killed a Jew here in, in Haifa. On the other side, also no Jews um, uh, killed an Arab inside Haifa. Uh, you, you, for years, the, my neighbors from above us, they, they lived here, uh, Arab students. You can go everywhere. You can you can hear an Arab and Arabic language and Hebrew language. I, I would say this is the most city which you can feel the coexistence, normal existence between uh, Jew between Jews and Arabs in living together in one in one city. So I adapted Haifa as um, I would say instead of Baghdad as my mother city. I said that it is um, um, the most near city where, the, where there is um, coexistence, but if I make a, a, a measure measurement how to how the what what is what is the coexistence, I would choose Haifa instead of Baghdad, instead of Damascus, instead of Beirut, instead of of. Uh, Cairo. If we see now the, what is going on in the Middle East, uh, Haifa will, I wouldn't say that it is ideal, the, the most ideal thing, but it's the very near town which you can say that, that here uh, for, a, 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 I would say, 60% of existence. So that uh, if you can see the, the, how, how the, the, this glass is full or, or, or empty, it is more full than empty. Of course, I wouldn't choose to be an Arab even in Haifa. Uh, because, of course, there is some kind of difference between Arabs and Jews in the, their rights, uh, rights. But still Haifa is the best city in the Middle East. And th that is, uh, I don't know if you saw the road on my name inside, uh, in, in Wadi Nisnas, where it's parts of my books are on the, on one of them. There's a road on my name. You can't find something like that in other city in, in Israel. You say, uh, you, uh, you know, I think even the Israeli government is not interested to to show the, the special atmosphere of Haifa. Not the, Arab, um, um, not the Arab countries and not even Israel, because it is against of what, whatever they say, the, the, the two sides, the Syrian, the Egyptian, the Palestinian, uh, Qaeda, and uh, I am talking about the, um, uh, how is the fighting, uh, organizations of Muslims and Jews, because it shows that you can live in another way. So that uh, Haifa is, is kept as if it is dangerous for the propaganda of the Israeli government and the Arab uh, governments. Uh, so the fe this festival is uh, um, a new voice declaring that this city has a, some kind of coexistence, something that you can't say about Jerusalem, you can't say about uh, Tel Aviv, and especially you can't say, uh, say it in the 
uh, occupied um, uh, territories uh, in Palestine. Uh, it is enough that I declare that I, I am patriot. I, am, I think that uh, <coughs> uh, Zionism is very dangerous for the Jewish people, concentrating uh, so much millions of Jews in very small countries in the most dangerous part of the world in the Middle East. And I say the only abnormal Jews is here, coming from all, bringing all, uh, from all of the, over the world Jews to live in the most dangerous area now in the, uh, in the world, which is the Middle East. Um, and I said the, the secret of the <coughs> uh, our living through the ages, the Jew people, uh, for more than 2,000 years, is the ability to move from a dangerous part to more more normal part. That the, uh, uh, the, the, we survived survived uh, because of the, our ability of mobiling from one part to other part. Bre uh, the deciding to build a Jewish country, it is a crime against the Jewish people. It is against the traditions of the, 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 uh, the, uh, the, uh, the Jewish tradition. In, in the Middle East, we talk in two languages. A language for the outside world, a language inside the world. We and the Arabs are the same. Are, we are both of us, are, uh, Jews and Arabs, are very fluent um, and very good in rhetoric uh, speech. We are two languages for the outside world and for the inside world. For instance, Amos Oz is regarded the uh, very humane, but he raised the battle's uh, orders before starting every war in Israel. There are some books which is uh, uh, published in English but not in Hebrew. So th the same thing is about the Arab uh, uh, side. Our intellectuals, their intellectuals, uh, they talk in two languages. Language for their people and language for outside. And the, the, the one who is not normal inside is, to me, is me, because I am part of the two parts. I am Arab, my mother language is Arabic, so that when, when I hear Aleph Bet Yoshua and read uh, Rasan Kanafani, I read also between the lines what they mean. What is the secret of this? No one who know, knows because, and as I said, maybe because we have no history. The history is the most dangerous weapon in the Middle East because the, in everything there are two versions of in, in history. Haifa has no history. That is the beautiful thing about Haifa. So that it, the, the, there is no religious uh, tension uh, inside the population of Haifa. Uh, it is not like uh, um, Jerusalem, the Muslims, they said, it is our city, the Christians, our city. Um, uh, the, the, you can't say that about uh, uh, Akko, Acre. Uh, it, they have, uh, I, I, I say, someone said that happy people uh, li are like happy women, they have no past. You know, for, for, for instance, the, the main centre, uh, street in Haifa, uh, where the municipality is there, it is on the name of Arab, Hassan Shukri. This is the only um, uh, Ara uh, Israeli street, which is called on the name of Arab. Of course there is, because they are minority. The, the, the worst place uh, to live as a part of a minority is in the Middle East, but we don't kill them. They don't kill us. 
We go every week twice at least on the Arab sides and the Arabs you can, they are living here. So much doctors, so much Arab lawyers, they, even they, they, we live together they, without uh, looking back, uh, afraid someone coming, com coming to kill you. Of course, they, they, there is a discrimination. They are my, a minority. This is the worst place in the Middle East the, the, to be a part of a minority. If you are Kurds in Iraq or Shiites in, uh, in, uh, in Lebanon or Christian uh, in, in, uh, in Egypt, I, you know, it is a secret even in Egypt to tell how much Christian are in the living in Egypt. The, they forbid uh, newspaper to tell how many churches are burned daily in, in Egypt. There's no, nothing like that in Haifa. Is there a solution to the Israeli Arab Israeli? I don't think so conflict? because it came, it came it became a, a religious co conflict. As, as the same as uh, there is no, I don't see a solution between relation between the Shiites and the Muslims in the Middle East. No one knows that this is the most um, uh, cruel, the most uh, ancient uh, um, uh, uh, conflict in the Middle East between the Shiites and the, uh, and the Sunnis, two kinds of Islam. The, both of them are Islamic. In the war between uh, Iraq, the Sunnis against the Iran, as soon as one million soldiers were killed. The killing in Lebanon between Mus uh, both, uh, both Muslims and Shiites. Yesterday, in my um, childhood city, Baghdad, uh, nearly one th 100 persons were killed only because of the, uh, the conflict between Shiites and the Muslims. Um, so that I don't think, and that there is a solution. Um, you know, the, there is something strange about the Middle East. During the ages, even the ancient ages, every power which tried to come to here uh, and to, uh, to conquer the place while be, be, being a part of another thing from outside is crushed totally. So, so, have, so, so what happened to the Mongolians? Uh, they, they were defeated here. And some of them became Muslims, the others went back. Uh, afterwards, the, um, uh, the Crusaders didn't uh, leave. And especially Israel, in the morning and after, in the noon at nine, we declare we are part of Europe. They, uh, while the history, the, uh, the modern history of the Arabs is throwing the English, the French, the, the Italians, are uh, con uh, that th th throwing away the Euro European uh, from here. The, the Arab countries and the Arab people suffered so much of the uh, imperialist uh, uh, Europe the, in the shape of b the British uh, occupation, uh, French occupation, Italian occupation. And we declare that we are part of, uh, of Europe. That is, we are part of your enemies. How, how, how do they accept us? Um, it is it's hard. I have nearly um, difficulty to talk with my grandchildren because, because they are taught with the mentality of the, their neighbor is not, he is uh, our foe, uh, is, my neighbor is our, our enemy. This is the background of uh, teaching on the both sides, Arabs and Jews are the same. In Arab countries and the Israel are the same. So uh, even my grandchildren, they said, ah, oh, how, how naive you are. You are a simplest people. You don't know how the, the, the Arabs are uh, monsters. 
The same thing happens on the other side. That is the education of what I call culture of war. And the neighbor means if you are Muslims, the Christians and the Jews are your enemies. You know that we have pogroms inside Israel against the Christians, but no one talk about it. No, the Arab, the, 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 even the Christians who are the, uh, the target of, of, uh, of this conflict between Islam and, uh, and the Christianity, they don't, don't talk uh, in outside the world. They, they talk be, 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 uh, uh, only among the, themselves. Cities will only be for 30 years, the majority there were uh, Christian and n now became Muslims. So between, even between the uh, people who are um, under the pressure of the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the establishment, are, uh, there is a tension between uh, Druze, between a Christian and Muslims. So that we talk in many languages. So, so this is a, the, 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 uh, the, the culture of fighting, not the culture of peace, of coexistence. You can find it in the uh, books we are, which are taught in, the, in, in uh, schools. Uh, you are uh, teaching to be a brave uh, Muslim, a brave Arab. The, the, uh, the ideal Arab, which is the fighter, and the same thing in the uh, in, uh, in school in the Jewish school. In terms of coexistence, the presence of a holy place like Baha'i shrine yes. is positive or negative? It is positive because the only place in the in the Middle East they found it is living here in Haifa. They found the secret uh, of the ability to live here without the fear of uh, someone come and, and put a, a, a bomb uh, in, in, inside their shrine there. While uh, they are sentenced to death in Iran because they are behind. And you see that they became a, in Israel a center of uh, visitors uh, of all uh, the, the the head of the Baha'i uh, is my uh, my my friend, uh, and I, I, I regarded him uh, my friend. He came, he, he received a doctor for honor from the uh, uh, um, uh, Haifa University last year. I recommended for him. They accepted to, and they're happy that he got it.